to my youtube channel thank you so much for always coming back to watch my youtube videos and in case it's your first time here kindly consider subscribing for more interesting videos like this one that we just about to make so here we make the most delicious foods using the most simple ingredients that you can find anywhere in the market and today i want to show you how to prepare simple omena this you're going to make for five minutes it only takes five minutes to prepare this omena using the simplest recipe that i'm going to show you so today i have my omena i have my grated tomatoes as always and i have my fine chopped onions and salt so today there is no spices we're just going to use onions and tomatoes so these ones are two tomatoes and one fine chopped onion and salt to taste so first things first you must have your boiled water yes it must boil to bubble and then you're going to add your hot water in your omena like that and let it soak for two minutes ensure all the omenas are covered in the hot water the reason why i use hot water first to soak my omena is just in case there are some sands or some small stones or just anything that may have been stuck in one of the omenas that may irritate the teeth when eating when you use hot water they loosen and you will find them at the base of the tin when you drain your water so that's why i use hot water and soak it for two minutes so when you get your omena from the market make sure you wash it thoroughly as you can see that is the first water the one that i used to soak it with because most omena when they are sun dried it's either they are sun dried on the sand or the small fish nets so it's possible that your omenas will carry sand and dust and this is the result so we're going to remove this from the water and rinse it in cold water So after washing and draining, this is what I have from my first water. So you can imagine if I went directly to cooking before washing. This I would have consumed. So our omena is washed. So we're going to need to rinse this one one more time because the water is still not so clear as you can see yeah so this one is just for a minute then we put a clean water so we're going to transfer this to a clean water we want clean omena so i washed my omena three times just to ensure that it is thoroughly clean so i'm going to transfer it to a clean bowl this is what we have it is this clean so next let's go into frying Ma. 
wait for your oil to heat before adding omeshle so my oil is well heated i'm going to add my omena After adding my omena like that, don't turn, just let it cook from the side you've, you've placed it on and turn your heat down so that it cooks because when the heat is too much, it's going to burn instead of cooking. So we cover that and let it cook for three minutes. So it's been three minutes. When you give it time to cook slowly like this, it cooks evenly. So how to kula omena unaskia ni kama haijaiva and then haita ungua. Na itakauka. Like haita ungua na itakua ile crunchy. So if you, you are the type that loves crunchy omena, this is how to prepare it. So we're going to cover it and let it cook for two more minutes. So at this point, I'm going to add my onions. My onions. And give my onions time to cook too. My onions are well cooked, so for those who don't like adding tomatoes to their omena, at this point you can just add salt and enjoy your crunchy tomatoless omena. I'm adding my tomatoes at this point. Then I add salt. Salt to taste. I want to maintain the crunchiness in my omena. I don't want it to be so soft. So I'm only going to cover it for one minute and let the tomatoes cook. So here is my omena. For the type that loves crunchy omena, this simple recipe is for you. You only need onions and tomatoes and give your omena time to cook and dry up under minimal heat so that it will not burn and it will cook properly. So let me prepare my yogali and show you how this is eaten. So if you are an omena lover, this, is, this simple recipe is for you. Make sure you try it at home. Comment below so that I know how your results will be i trust you you're going to love this as usual i'm going to leave the ingredients in the description box make sure you watch before you prepare your omena yeah thank you so much for watching my videos until next time bye guys remember to comment like share and most importantly subscribe